Schools across the Central Coast are days away from resuming instruction. But at the Monterey Peninsula Unified School District, at least one teaching assistant claims she and her colleagues at the Extended Learning Opportunities Department are being required to host in-person class with as many as a dozen students. All this while she says teachers can work remotely. In a statement given over the phone, the TA, who wanted to remain anonymous, says she believes it's pretty unfair. At the end of the day, we are putting ourselves at risk, like in my situation where I have a family. I come from work, and if something happens to me or I get infected, then I'm coming bringing that into my house. The district says under the state's COVID-19 guidance for schools, they are allowed to host these kinds of in-person programs. But the TA is still concerned about exposure. While she understands the district has provided safety protocols and supplies for work, She's still afraid of the in-person interaction. The district says in a survey they took, most of the ELO staff feel comfortable coming back to the work site. But the TA claims she got an email stating if she cannot continue with the ELO portion of her work, then she'll have to fill out a leave of absence. She says, I'm left with no choice. I have bills. I have a family I have to support. I can't afford to just say, okay, fine. I'm going to quit, and that's that.